Welcome back fans of All Things Disney. Today's latest video is going to be a haul video from the Character Warehouse locations as well as Disney Springs. I had a short shopping list but we had an awful lot of fun finding all of these different goodies and then of course we had to go over and do a monorail crawl to do a little bit of pin trading for the upcoming next pin sale. If you're new to the channel, I am a personal shopper, so if you're seeing anything that you'd like for me to get for you at the outlets, please feel free to send me an email at mickeysmagicaldelivery at gmail.com. I will also have an extras section at the very end. One of the things that I try to do is I try to pick up a few extra things here, a few extra things there, and then make those available for anybody who would like to place an order. This allows people to kind of maximize their shopping charge because the personal shopping fee is 20% of your order or $10, whichever one is greater. So you want to kind of keep that in mind. If you see anything in the extras that you would like to also purchase, you are welcome to do so again by sending me an email at mickeysmagicaldelivery at gmail.com. But just keep in mind that that personal shopping charge will apply. And then later in the day, I will post all of the extras that I have left to Facebook. At that point, it is best simply to comment on the Facebook page if you'd like to get an extra. But all of that information on personal shopping is in the description box below. So let's get started with our haul. Okay, first thing in the haul, and these will be mostly extras. I do have two of the Dooney Cats totes. I was able to get two of those. And then I have a crossbody. I also have two of the wristlets. And this pattern is just adorable. So if you're anybody like me and you just love all things about Disney cats, you can kind of see what most of the pattern looks like there. The totes are nearly identical in terms of pattern. The crossbodies are a little bit different. I have one that has Marie kind of front and center there. And then I have another one that has kind of Lucifer and Marie on the front for the wristlets, I should say. The crossbody itself has Cheshire Cat kind of prominently displayed with Marie off to the side here. But then you can see the tote design. Now the prices, let's take a quick look at these Dooney prices. $74.99 for the wristlet, which is an amazing price. You also could turn that into a little bit of a wallet if you wanted to. $124.99 for the crossbody, also a great price for a crossbody. And then for the totes, it's not marked here, but I want to say they were $149.99. And again, I have two of those. Also something that I picked up that was new this last time, this is a Star Wars limited edition bifold wallet, and it's coming from the Mandalorian series is my understanding. So I have that one. The price is $14.99, and they did have quite a few of them. So if anybody wanted one, I could certainly pick up the next time I was there. I do have a few extra of the fantastic disposable utensil set. So this is $12.99. It is from the Epcot Food and Wine Festival. And when you snap it open, you can see you've got your reusable, not disposable, you have your reusable fork, spoon, knife, straw cleaner, and of course straw because we know Disney does not give out straws anymore. So that might be a great thing, either for your own lunch or for a trip to Disney. And I do have a few extra of those. Those are $12.99. I did pick up a few extra of these Snow Much Fun. Yep, Snow Much Fun. These are light up ears and they were $7.99. So that is an awesome price for those. And I do have a few extras. This one I don't have an extra for. This is one that my friend that goes shopping with me had said, you have to get this, you have to get this. So of course I had to get this. This is a stroller organizer for my granddaughter's stroller, but they do have several of them. They have plenty. So if you wanted me to get you one, you can see kind of the different designs there on the organizer. And these are $12.99 down from $24.99. So again, if you are planning an upcoming trip or you just needed a Disney themed organizer, they do have those. I did grab a few extra boxes of the Disney Dogs socks. So there's four pairs of crew socks for $5.99. You can see that there. And I do have a few extras there. I did pick up two extra of these awesome Food and Wine Festival towels. These are $10.99 down from $19.99. And you can see you've got Mickey and Minnie with the orchard apples on the front. And then the other towel in the set 
is a bit more simplistic, but it's got the Upcut Food and Wine logo and it's got the apples on it. So if you have an apple themed kitchen or if you just love Disney kitchen towels, $10.99 for that. Then last thing on this table that I grabbed from the warehouse, they had these adorable little spreaders. They were two spreader set, $10.99 down from $19.99. And this one is of course Jacques and Gus Gus. So I have that one and then I have a few other designs over on the other table. Over at Disney Springs, I did end up getting this awesome Dumbo lounge fly backpack. It's just adorable. It's the little Dumbo ride itself. Somebody had specifically requested. And I do not pick up extras when I'm at Disney Springs, um, typically only because the price is so high. Uh, the character warehouse is a different story entirely, but at Disney Springs, I can grab anything that you need me to get. It is open to the public, so I can go through any time, and I can grab anything that you need. And then speaking of that, Lily Pulitzer goodies. So I did have a customer that asked me to grab some Lily Pulitzer with that new awesome print that they have there. So there is this fabulous notebook. I actually grabbed one for myself for the upcoming birthday. So this notebook is only $18. And just look at that print. It's beautiful. It's got the castle, Minnie and Mickey, very tropical. And then a pair of the shorts. The shorts are a little bit on the expensive side, but they are gorgeous. So the shorts are 78. Let me see if I can zoom in on that. It's either 78 or 78.99. I can't quite see without my glasses, but $78. And it's that same gorgeous tropical print with this beautiful little like scalloped edging on the shorts themselves and then one last item for lily pulitzer is this fabulous little tumbler same print obviously um but the price on that one is 24 dollars. so beautiful beautiful prints all right so moving on over to the other table you can see i've got a whole bunch of those dog socks but then here are those other spreaders so we have lumiere and cogsworth for beauty and the beast fans then there is Rex and, of course, a little Alien. And again, those were $10.99 for the two spreader sets, down from $19.99. Then I did grab one of the Cinderella spatulas. This was $10.99 down from $14.99, but it was just too beautiful to pass up. So I had to go ahead and grab one. And then, of course, I did have a request for these fabulous light-up droid headbands. So we've got the BB-8. These are already spoken for. Those won't be extras and also R2-D2. So you can see those there, and I'm looking for prices, and unfortunately, they are not on there, but I think that they were fairly reasonable. But I know that they give prices in some of the other walkthrough videos. If anybody wants one, I can try to dig out that price for you though, so just let me know. I did grab a few of the $2.99 Christmas light up necklaces, so if anybody did want that, I will have a few extra of those. And then here are some of the pins that I grabbed at Pin Traders. So this one is already spoken for. Somebody asked me to get this one. This is the limited edition uh, anniversary collection pin. So I did grab that. This one came from Character Warehouse. And this one is specific to an order. Somebody asked me to get it. But they do have lots of these Heroes and Villains pins available. And those are all $9.99. Oh, and I'm sorry. The limited edition pin was $39.99. And then we have, this was one of the new family pins, and it is from Robin Hood, so I had to grab it. I have so many um, pin sale customers that love that movie, so I went ahead and got it. And this one is $15.99. I'm going to check to see if either of them wants one first, and then I will put those in the extras pile if I don't hear back. I do have a $12.99 Sword in the Stone pin, another film that I know people really, really love, so I grabbed that. And then Beauty and the Beast pen. I had a request for one, so I grabbed the second. This one is only $9.99. They had a new Magical Mystery pin pack. Now, these won't be for sale. These are ones that I picked up just for myself. But they are Tinkerbell. They're Tinkerbell themed. So I'm going to open these for the upcoming pin sale. And you can see the price on the Magical Mystery pins has now gone up to $8 or $7.99. I did pick up a couple of the Electrical Parade pins as I saw them. There were two that were available for purchase at Pin Traders the other day. So I grabbed two of these. These are This one is limited release and it is a trifold. So let's get that opened up here. 
It is a tri-fold. It doesn't lay flat. So if you were thinking for a pin board, that might not be your best idea, but you can see how you've got three of the different floats there in the tri-fold design. And then, I know you're only seeing one, but that's because one immediately went into my collection. This is an Elliott pin that will be available, and this is $17.99. If somebody wanted it off of a personal shopping order, we can certainly do that. Otherwise, it will be available in the pin sale. All right, and then the Florida Bird, the Dangle, new pin that was just released for $12.99. Then I did grab two boxes of the new Princess Cake Slices or cakes, I should say. And here are the different ones. These are not gonna be for sale off of this haul. I'm going to do a separate um, unboxing for these, getting ready for the next pin sale. But I wanted to show you that, yes, they do have these right at Disney Springs. All right, and then in terms of other pins. So I was able to get one of each. I could have gotten more, but I went for one of each. I have a Peter Pan, which I know somebody has already requested. This is the four pin set. They came from the Heroes and Villains uh, pin event. These were originally $50, and they're down to $25.99. Then I have a Meet the Robinsons, and I just love this. Look at this awesome, look at that. That is just so cool. Look at that. That is an awesome, awesome limited, I think these are limited release. Doesn't it probably says on the back and I just can't see. But I think the Meet the Robinsons will be available. I'm almost positive that my Great Mouse Detective one is already taken. I'm sure that that was on somebody's list. But the Sword in the Stone one may be available. And you can kind of see the Sword in the Stone one here. So I know for sure I have at least one, maybe two of these if you were looking for one. And four pins, limited release pins for $25.99 with the packaging, that's a fantastic price. Then we have um, some Marvel socks. These were special requests, but just to show you that they are still there for $4.99. Somebody had asked me to get two pairs of the Falcon socks. Black Spire Outpost hat. Let's see if these are marked. Sometimes they do and they do. $7.99. And then Never Grow Up. Two mummy popcorn buckets were requested this last week, so I did grab those. You can see I have a few more snow, snow much fun ears. And then we'll come on over to the clothing. And I did um, grab a few extras of different things, or I will probably have extras of a few things. This one is an extra. This awesome pair of, uh, like they're uh, sweatpants, I guess I should say. So these are sweatpants and they've got Chip and Dale on them. I grabbed an extra large, but I just thought they were so cute. $24.99 down from $44.99. So I have an extra large in this and you can see you've got the Chip and Dale kind of running down the side. And then you have Chip and Dale, of course, on the front. So I have those in an extra large. And then somebody had asked me to get extra large leggings. So I kind of grabbed whatever I could find there in extra large. And one of the patterns that they had this weekend, they actually had quite a few different sizes in the cats, the Disney cats leggings for $24.99. <clears throat> so those I have. And then I also grabbed an extra large in this awesome, oh my gosh, I just love this color, with the silver Walt Disney World running down the side. It just is so reminiscent to me of the monorails and reminiscent of like the 70s. So I just thought that these were adorable and you could really wear them with anything. Look at the colors that are down at the bottom. And they're just really awesome leggings. And again, $24.99 down from $39.99 in size extra large. Then they did have the Halloween Hocus Pocus leggings as well. So I'll just show you the close-up pattern there. Really, really beautiful leggings. So they're mostly black, but they have that strip down the side. This was a special request from somebody, so this is love. But just to give you a little bit of a closer look at what that t-shirt looks like. So it's clearly Cinderella themed. You've got the shoe with the birds. Got the, So this is love logo on the front. And again, this was a special request. This one was $29.99 down from $54.99. So we do have that. And then another special request, and they had so much new clothing this week. It was great to go shopping just to see. This one, my friend had to really point it out to me because I almost overlooked it. Do you see a little Sebastian in 
the print. Kind of looks like a bandana print hoodie, but it's got little Sebastian in there, and it's such a sweet little design. This one is $29.99 down from $54.99. And again, that was a specific request from somebody. Hocus Pocus sweatshirt. It's just a bunch of Hocus Pocus. They've had this for uh, several weeks, actually, but I have not been able to get the size that I needed. This week they had it. So that's always the case with the outlets. They may or may not have something you want right in that moment, but they hopefully will eventually get it. It is not marked in terms of price. Yes, it is. $29.99 down from $49.99, and that was a size large. Again, a very specific request. Last few items over here. This one is coming from Disney Springs. I had a couple people that wanted this sweatshirt, but I could only find one of the sizes that I needed. We did go to several places. We actually ended up going into all of the different shops for pin trading and the monorail. So I was able to find this over in one of the monorail locations. But just look at how gorgeous that print is. And this is a zip up hoodie, but this is the back here. And just to give you an idea of price in case this was something that you wanted. Oh, and then look, you've got the 50th anniversary print in the hood. And of course the 50th logo on the front. But let's see here, this one is $64.99. So if you wanted one like that, they are $64.99. Again, they're full price when I'm going to Disney Springs or to the resorts to get something, but still really beautiful merchandise. All right, now the last couple of things, these are for my grandbaby. Okay, so they will not be extras, but I wanted to show you some of the new things that they came out with. So this one here is this gorgeous little holiday dress. It doesn't say anything about the holidays, but it's clearly, you've got your little snowflakes and all of that. And look at that skirt. She was born in February, so she'll be, you know, about 10 months old when the holidays hit. But this was $19.99 down from $34.99, and it was one I just had to get because it's gorgeous. We had already gotten the white little dress, but this one I think was my favorite out of the two, and when they finally brought it in, it had to come home. Another thing they had to come home is the My First Christmas PJs. They have not had these, or at least since I've seen them, so I had to get these. Hi, Mushi. My cat just decided to jump up and join me, so I had to get these for her. It says My First Christmas. You've got little Mickey Mouse on the feet there, so sweet. And then, let's get you a price here. Oh, I'm sorry, it does have a little matching hat as well to wear at night, $12.99 for that. So that's one of the main reasons that I went ahead and I grabbed this one, but let's be honest, if it's anything adorable for the grandbaby, it's gonna come home. And then last thing I got for her is I got this little awesome bucket hat because down here in Florida, we're in the pool all the time. So I got this one over at Disney Springs. It's UPF 50. And let's see, I was surprised at the price. It was only $14.99. So that kind of surprised me. It's got the little chin strap here as well, little chin strap. So it'll stay on her head. But if you needed a bucket hat for your little one, they had two styles at Disney Springs. They had the Mickey Mouse one and they had a stitch one, which was a little bit more. It was $19.99, but it was really adorable. My daughter wanted me to go more for the simplistic red Mickey, so that's what I ended up doing. Okay guys, so that does it for this week's haul video. I do try to shop every two to three weeks. Okay guys, it is that time in the video where what you're about to see are only extras. That means they have not been claimed. They are completely up for grabs. If you see something that you would like, you can send me an email at mickeysmagicaldelivery at gmail.com. I take them in the order that I receive them, so please keep that in mind. Start a new email if you're sending me more than one message, otherwise it will drop your previously sent email lower into the queue. So you wanna keep that in mind. In about an hour or two, once the emails have slowed down, then I will post the extras to Facebook. And once they're on Facebook, your best bet is to claim them right on that platform. So hopefully you find some extras that you want. But as I said earlier in the video, please keep in mind there is a 20% shopping fee or $10 minimum shopping fee, whichever one is greater that you want to account for in this as well. So enjoy the extras and hopefully you see something that you would like.
first thing in the extras pile will of course be a couple of boxes of these Disney dog socks. There's four crew socks for a total of $5.99. They don't really give you um, what they look like, but you can see two of them in there. And then we have all of the different spreaders. So these were $10.99. I have one from Toy Story, one from Beauty and the Beast, and of course one from Cinderella. I do have one of the reusable uh, utensil sets left for $12.99. The double kitchen set, towel set for $10.99. I have two of those and they are double towels. And then I also have this Cinderella spatula for $10.99 as well. Also, as far as kitcheny items go, I do still have quite a few of these can holders or koozies. These are Disney koozies, and let's see here. They were originally $7.95, but when I purchased them, they were $4.99. So if anybody would like one, I have about four of them. So if you're looking for something like that, upcoming Father's Day or whatever it might happen to be. All right, in terms of pins, I do have some of the Dumbo. I have some of the Pirates, some of the Peter Pan, and then I also have the Main Street USA. Any of those boxed pins are $7.99. That's what I got them for from the outlet. So $7.99. Then down into some of the other ones that I've purchased from the outlet as well as Disney Springs. So please try to listen for prices. So the Heroes and Villains ones are all $9.99. I have the Gaston one. I also have one from Beauty and the Beast for $9.99. I have a Fine and Dandy from 101 Dalmatians for $9.99. Then I have the Star Wars, Join the Resistance for $9.99. Princess Leia, and then the Enlist, all from Star Wars for $9.99. And then last but not least, I have two of these um, Magic Mirror Disney Villains ones for $9.99 as well. They're like a mood, a mood pin. There's something kind of interesting. They're limited edition, but for $9.99. Then let's take a look at some of the others. I have one of the Orange Bird Dangles. This one was $12.99. I have one left. I have one of the Sword in the Stone, that was $12.99. I have two of the Electrical Parade, brand new limited release pins for $19.99. I have one left of the new Beauty and the Beast mirror pin for $9.99. I have two of the Robin Hood family pins for $15.99. And I do have a bunch of these still left from the last pin sale. I purchased them for $2.99. So these are, um, they're pin on pin. $2.99 make a great trader. So I've got some for the Timberwolves. I have some for the 76ers. And I also have a couple, I believe that's what, Golden State Warriors or something like that. Then over here, I have two of these pin sets from Heroes and Villains. This one is Meet the Robinsons for $25.99. And then I have one from Sword in the Stone. And this one is also $25.99. They're all four pin sets, both of those. Flower and Garden Pins, limited release for $17.99. So if you still needed one of those. I do have this awesome Mandalorian wallet. That was $14.99. It is a bifold wallet. I have two left of the holiday necklaces. If you needed one, those are $2.99 each. Then over to the Doonies. I have a crossbody, and I gave the price earlier, but I think I've got it right here, $124.99. That is available. I have two of the cat wrist lists for $74.99, each of them. And then I have two of the full cat totes. Those are $149.99. I do still have one of the Dooney and Burke crossbodies. This one is the... Um, it was the winter pattern, the gray winter pattern. Okay, and this is $119.99. It was not quite 50% off, but it was still a great price considering that they have not come back to the outlets. Then I do have one pair of the holiday slippers. These were a size medium for $14.99. A few of the Snow Much Fun light up ears for $7.99. I have three of those remaining if anybody needed some. And then this awesome pair of Chippendale sweatpants for $24.99. They are size extra large. Then I have an extra large in this holiday cardigan for $24.99. 
This I didn't see at all in the shops yesterday, so those seem to be sold out. I have an Otter Box for an iPhone XS Max that was $7.99. Then a set of buttons for $2.99. I'm here for the ears. I'm here for the autographs. I have two different keychains, one Minnie Mouse, one Castle, and then the other side of this one is Castle during the day. Those are both $4.99. Then I have a Fantasy Shadow Box from Disney Cruise Line. You've got Dumbo there. That one is $9.99. Let me just double check and make sure. Yes, $9.99. Then I have a Disney Cruise Line photo frame ornament. This one was, I believe... $4.99. And then a Holiday at Sea tote from Disney Cruise Line. That was $9.99. And then rounding us off is this adorable little mini handbag for $12.99. But I am going to drop it to $9.99 because I've had it for a while. Even though you can't get it at the warehouse anymore, it's just too cute. And I would love for a little bitty to be enjoying that. It's got Minnie Mouse's signature. It's got the little strap so you can wear it as a crossbody or a little girl as a crossbody. But I have seen actually some adults kind of walking around with that as well. So $9.99 for that. But with summer vacation coming up, I am going to be increasing that to maybe even a trip every week. But we'll just kind of see what the um, what kind of the demand is and see if I need to do every week or if like once every other week. But we will absolutely be increasing the amount that we are shopping over the summer since I'll be home. And that would work just fine. So if you are interested in personal shopping, again, just send me an email at Mickey's Magical Delivery. If you see any extras or if you saw any extras at the end of the haul video that you want, please feel free to send me an email, Mickey's Magical Delivery at gmail.com. But also keep in mind that that 20% or $10 personal shopping fee, whichever one is greater, does apply. So keep that in mind. You may or may not be in time to grab the extras that you want. I go first come, first serve. So please just make sure that you're kind of keeping all of that in mind if you are grabbing an extra. Any questions, feel free to reach out. But until our next video, bye-bye.